Hi friends, welcome back to Godly Play. I'm so glad that you have joined us today on the seventh Sunday of Easter. Let's take our deep breaths in and out together as we get ready to hear our story. Take a deep breath in and out. Deep breath in and out. One more deep breath in and out. I think we're ready. Today, we will remember how the disciples returned to Jerusalem. They gathered in their room and Jesus was there too. They were more comfortable now with the new way of knowing him and so they asked many questions. Most of them were foolish. Lord, will you restore the kingdom of Israel? Jesus cut short such talk. It is not for you to know the time or the seasons. Then he led them out of the room through the streets. They went beyond the walls of Jerusalem to a hillside, perhaps near Bethany. Jesus stopped and they gathered around him. He lifted up his hands and looking at each one, he blessed them. He then withdrew and a cloud took him out of sight. The disciples stood looking at the sky until someone said, why are you looking up into the sky? There were two men standing there dressed in white. The disciples felt silly. What were they doing looking up at the sky for what they could no longer see? The strangers then answered their own question. This was Jesus. He is now gone as you have known him. It seems like a great weight has been lifted off of their shoulders. The disciples turned and they walked back to Jerusalem. Now they had to wait. What was this Holy Spirit he said was coming? How would they know it when it arrived? They waited and they waited. While they waited, they found someone to replace Judas. God helped them find Matthias. So now they were the 12 once more. But they still had to keep waiting. How long would it take for the Holy Spirit to come? I wonder what part of this story you liked the best. I wonder what part of the story you think is the most important. And I wonder if you might have something in your house that could remind you of this part of the story or that might help tell this story. Friends, thank you so much for joining me again for Godly Play. We miss you here at Decatur Presbyterian Church and we cannot wait to be back together. Remember that we love you and God loves you and God is with us all until we meet again. Bye friends.